Cooperative learning. Well, what is it? It's basically a group of students who are working together to accomplish a structured task or lesson. There are five basic elements that go into it. Positive interdependence, individual and group accountability, interpersonal and small group skills, face-to-face -face promotive interaction, and group processing. What is the difference between collaborative and cooperative learning? An example of students with collaborative learning looks something like this. Look closely at what each student is doing. What do you notice? In collaborative learning, students do not have incentive to take their work seriously because they are graded on behalf of the group not individually. I have a question. What is... The fatal flaw of collaborative learning is that the work is not divided evenly. This means not every student needs to do the work to get the same amount of credit. Jigsaw is a method of organizing classroom activity that makes students dependent on each other to succeed. Daniel? You'll become an expert in the content of the first chapter of the book. Carson, you'll be doing the same for chapter two. Ryan, you've got chapter three. Devin, you have chapter four. Each of you will be researching the content of that chapter, and at the end of the period, you'll be pulling your resources together in order to paint a final picture of what those grouped cluster of chapters are really about. This is the core of Jigsaw Method of Cooperative Learning. Now this is one of the most important elements of cooperative learning. Now the students are sharing their findings with each other, bringing that jigsaw all together in order to accomplish the final product. This is really one of the keys to improving learning among groups of students cooperatively rather than collaboratively. When dividing students into cooperative learning groups, it is best to ensure diversity amongst your students. This will ensure that students develop social skills such as trust building, communication, and decision making. It will also create more benefits for students of all academic strengths.